everybody, my name is Becky and I welcome you to my muscle function video series. This week we're going to be going over the pectineus muscle. I will go over its location, which includes the origin and insertion, followed by its functions, and then finally providing you an exercise so you know how to strengthen this muscle the best way. So let's get started with the location so we know exactly where we're talking about and then we'll build from there. So the pectineus muscle is originated on your pubis just above the crest now the the muscle is actually the origin or the starting point is actually a one inch wide band and then it runs down to your femur and it inserts from about the bottom of the lesser trochanter and then just below that to the lena alba so just to kind of give you a pinpointed area about on a human body, I'm going to go ahead and pin out, pinpoint out the general area that it is on my body and then I'll provide you an illustration so you know exactly what I'm talking about. So when we talk about the pubis, we're talking about your pubic bone and again that is a one inch wide band across just above the crest. And then it runs down from here down to your femur here just beneath that lesser trochanter and then it runs down a little bit to lena alba so it's kind of like a rough line to that lena alba um, but just in case you are a little bit confused obviously i can't show you an actual skin human body just out of respect for myself but I'm going to go ahead and provide you an illustration so you know exactly what I'm talking about. So here's that illustration for you. Okay, so now that we know exactly where the pectineus muscle is, now we can move on and apply its functions. So the primary and first most important function of this muscle is hip flexion. So this is its primary function, once again. Um, moving on to the secondary functions, it also assists with hip adduction and hip external rotation. So just in case you aren't quite sure of what those functions actually are, I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate them for you. So looking at hip flexion, you're looking at movement from this region in the hip. So looking at hip flexion, you're looking at bringing the leg up. With hip adduction, if your leg is already away from you and you pull it inwards, that is hip adduction. So it does assist with this movement, but again, it's not its primary function. This is a secondary function. The third function of the pectineus muscle is hip external rotation and again this is a secondary function it is not its primary function so looking at hip external rotation you're actually looking at moving your knee from pointing forward to pointing out that's all you're doing is just rotating your knee outwards almost kind of like you were to go sit in indian style so now that you know where this muscle is and what it does, now we can move on to the most important part of the video, which is the exercise portion. So again, like I said, the primary function is hip flexion. So we are looking at exercises that are going to demonstrate that movement in order to strengthen this muscle the best. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and insert a few video clips of some exercise examples. Uh, if you have any limitations or anything, please uh, keep in mind of your own body. You may alter them in order to get them to your level, whether you are novice or advanced, either or. Uh, but if you guys have any questions after the video, you can go ahead and post them below, but for now, I'm going to go ahead and give you some examples. So here they are.
Okay guys, thank you so much for watching my video. If you liked it or found value in it, hit the like button, pass it on with a share. Um, if you have any comments or questions, please insert them into the comment section below. I will try to get to everybody. And if I happen to miss something, please feel free to re-ask it and I will definitely try to get back to you. So, I hope everybody has a great week and I will see you all again Sunday.